I now declare this partnership business officially open. Speaking during the launch in Embu County, Azuri Technologies CEO Simon Bransfield said that solar power has made huge strides all over the world. This is the first time that Kenyans, wherever they live, have been able to get television, even if they have no power, even if they have no television signal in the normal way. Kenyans wishing to own the solar TV will have access to the equipment on a rent-to-buy basis for 149 shillings a day and after two years own the entire system. This includes the solar power, batteries, TV, lighting, chargeable radio, torch and mobile phone charger. But this is another step in bringing power to rural Kenya and enabling everybody in Kenya to have access to television and to the trappings of modern development, not just the people who live in cities, but every single citizen of the country. The launch of the service comes 10 months after MCOPA launched a similar solar TV system. According to Kenya Digital TV Focus report, despite Kenya having over 12 million households, the TV household penetration rate is at 38.2% as of 2015. This also enables us to deliver Zuku TV to, to homes that were previously inaccessible to us, homes which do not have electricity. Hilda Wadidi, Citizen Live at One.